In this video, we're going to learn how to get screenshots for a list of URLs in Airtable. You can see here I've got a list of URLs in this URL field. The next thing you need to do is to create a field called screenshot with type attachment. Then create a new grid view called needs screenshot and add the following filters to that view. Add URL is not empty and screenshot is empty and as we create the screenshots our records are going to move out of this filtered view so next go to the Airtable app marketplace and install the free data fetcher app then sign up for a free data fetcher account or sign into your existing account then click on create your first request and for application select microlink and for endpoint select create screenshots from URLs. Then change the name to Fetch Screenshots and click Save and Continue. For the URL, we want to use the URL values in our table, so click on the Add icon on the right hand side to create a reference. And for the table, we want Screenshots. For Field, select URL and make sure the view here is Need Screenshot. Then click Confirm and we can see that's created a reference to that URL field in the screenshots table. Um, you can also set these options if you want to and make sure the output table and view is also screenshots and needs screenshot. Then click save and run in the bottom right and continue. And Microlink is going to create the screenshot and we'll see all the fields that come back from Microlink. So click filter all to remove them all and then click on the screenshot one and make sure that's mapped to the existing field called screenshot. Finally click save and run and data fetcher is going to connect to microlink and create a screenshot for each URL in Airtable and as it does that the records are going to move out of that filtered view. Going back to the grid view we can see that those screenshots are created as file attachments in the screenshot field. So open up data fetcher again and you can close this warning message. If you hit the free limit of microlink, which is 100 requests a day, then you can open this top section, get an API key, which you'll need to purchase from microlink and change the authorization type to header and enter that API key here. The other thing to note is that you can schedule this to run automatically. To do this, you'll need to upgrade to a paid data fetcher account. Set your schedule here and click save. And data fetcher will then create those screenshots from the URLs in Airtable on an automatic schedule whenever there's records in that need screenshot view.